Good morning. Hold on. Sloppy around. Boop. I went to the gym this morning, so I'm a little bit, a little bit rough looking. But hello, welcome. Carberry Custom Color friends, friends, family, past, present, past, present, and future clients. We are over here in um, the Blakeney area, um, and um, we. Um, We've uh, painted probably three quarters of the house, uh, and we also um, breathed new life to the deck. Um, the homeowners had just closed on their house about two weeks ago, and um, they moved in, and so they are in the process of making it their own, and we are here to help. So I'm going to turn around. Uh, we're just about done uh, with the interior house painting. We're just going to uh, go through now. now and um, and I will talk you through all the stuff that we have done. So let me turn you around. Here we are. Hey, Elmer. <laughs> so um, the colors that are used in here are popular gray and requisite gray. Um, so this room was actually already done. Um, and they didn't hate it, so they kept it. And I said, well, why don't we reuse those colors? So we're working with it, not against it. And so that's what we did. So we've got um, a nice fresh coat of a nice neutral color. Um, we did the bathroom in here. That bedroom reads it into. I'm going to take you around this way. So this was all um, sunshine yellow <laughs> and like this royal blue color that you see here behind the. Um, the backsplash, um, which uh, she's going to put a backsplash up there, so obviously we didn't paint it, but that was literally the entire kitchen. It was terrible. <laughs> um, and then, um, so yeah, so it's no longer sunshine yellow and royal blue. Fantastic. Um, we also have the downstairs here, and then I'll take you, actually I can't even take you out through the deck because we've got that old plastic off, but... Um, um, they've got a nice finished basement down here. Um, with a kitchen, wet bar. This was so dark in here um, before. They had a dark trim and dark walls. I'm assuming they use it for like a theater room or something before. So we just brightened it up a little bit. Um, I can't take you out there because you can see that there's plastic over everything because we're about to spray the deck. But I'm going to take you upstairs. Um, the deck was just in terrible shape. Um, it, I think it had been been up for about 10 to 15 years, and they had never stained it, and there was just layers of layers of mildew and mold um, that was growing everywhere. So there was lots of wood rot that we had to um, remove and replace. So I'll show you that. Here's the deck. Hi, Sarah. Um, so we've got uh, treks on the ground and treks on the top handle, and then everything else was pretty much green um, because of the amount of layers and layers of mold and mildew. I mean, this was all green. Um, the kick plates were green. It was bad, but now it looks good. So I'm happy. Um, all these kicks plates were green. And when I tell you green, like algae green. It was terrible. Um, so thank God I have the best power washer ever. Power washer person ever, I should say, because it's not my power washer. And uh, he came and cleaned for us. Um, this entire section here, this entire area, we had to remove it all. Um, it was all rotted. They had the posts going into the ground, so they were completely um, and um, so what we did was we actually poured concrete, extended the concrete out a little bit, and put the last step on the concrete, so we took the, that final step out to, to be level with, um, with the concrete that's already there, so you can see. So that is all new wood that we put up there. The posts are new. Um, 
and uh, we used the, the bolsters and um, and repaired all of that for them. So we're going to be um, painting this underside. There's a lot of moisture back here, um, and so we want to make sure that these beams underneath the deck are um, are protected and treated and, and will last uh, a long time. So um, that's where we are right now. So we'll get all this um, stained out. And, uh, and we'll be back tomorrow to, to close the job out. So, we'll see you soon.